Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the welterweight bout between um, Abubakar Nurmagomedov versus Gassi Omar Gassiev. So, welterweight bout Abubakar Nurmagomedov versus Gassi Omar Gassiev. And how I see this one is I'm going to go average confidence, Gassi Omar Gassiev. So, if you watched my little pre fight analysis, I was leaning Abubakar. But then really going back into it and not just like leaving it to memory and just really looking at this fight, I had to switch to Gassi Omar Garcia. Not a high confidence, definitely not lock, but I feel like he has a good enough case to win this one for some good reasons. I've like really overlooked his striking, but I look back and his striking looked pretty clean. Pretty, uh, I thought, his striking looked pretty clean and whatnot. Looked pretty effective. And also got to look at the fact was like... He lost to one of the best prospects at middleweight right now, who's a just like a BJJ ace, underrated striker. Yeah, I'm back in. I forgot where I was at. Y'all gonna like, what are you talking about? You were just talking and just continue, but there was a little pause right there and I'm back. But um, yeah, well, I'm just gonna make this short. I'm not gonna try to drag it out. One thing, Abubakar Nurmagomedov was probably the most disappointing Nurmagomedov. Whether he's affiliated or not affiliated with Khabib, I mean, he is affiliated with Khabib, but I'm talking about as far as all Nurmagomedovs, I know some of them aren't actually you know, close relatives of Khabib. They like, this is not my blood or this is not my brother, this is not my cousin. I don't associate with that Nurmagam at all. Like with those people like that, I'm just saying all Nurmagam that we know of in MMA or UFC high level Nurmagam offs. He is the most disappointing Nurmagam of all of them all. And not only that will ever change. And we look at his record, like he got a win over Jerry Gould and like, cool, all right. Then the probably outside of that, his only win is decent win is probably like, um, what's the name? I forget his name, right? Doomsday Howard. What's his name? James John Howard. Yeah, John Howard, who was like 40 at the time. So, nonetheless, look at his wins. He really beat no one. Omar Gassi, if, uh, got, well, Gassi, Gassi, I said Omar. Gassi, oh, yeah. Gassi, Omar Gassi, if, man, these names. <laughs> As for a better competition, for in beating a better competition. And also seemed like um, he's better in the grappling part, man. I feel like um, Abubakar struggles in submission grappling as well. And I feel like the better submission grappler is Gassi Omar Gassi. I don't know how the weight cut would affect him. I mean, he looked kind of undersized for middleweight, and now he's at welterweight, so I don't feel like the weight cut should affect him too much. Then again, and then also going there, I feel like striking-wise, we got to see it. I feel like um, Gassi has been striking more and been shown to be a more polished striker over time. Whereas, like, oh, Abubakar, we... He's really started to now show some growth in the striking where I feel like Omar Gassi has already shown that growth over his career. So it, that's the way it kind of comes down to who can probably win the striking battle and then set up their takedowns. But ultimately, I feel like even then, that's going to be it's going to be a tough fight. But then when those missing life, like those, it just really start to come down to muscle memory. Abubakar's muscle memory is to choke and um, or choke tap or whatever the case is. And Omar Gassi or Gassi Omar Gassi thing is to lock in those submissions. So I just feel like this fight goes on. They start to go back to the instincts. And I just feel like um the ground exchange, he's able to get a leg on like roll for a leg lock and tap out um a Bubakar in the second round. So yeah, I see it as a scrappy fight, back and forth fight, but Omar Gassi have getting better as the fight goes on. And then eventually start to find some holes in the grappling of Abubakar Nurmagomedov and taps him out second round. So in this one, I got Gassi Omar Gassiev via second round submission. 